you like friends, Barely fun, that, and beer, yeah. you'll want to be in Stevens Point this weekend. The Stevens Point Brewery will kick off the fourth Pointtoberfest. You can explore all the different types of beers that we are now brewing here and all the different types of hard ciders. Uh, we have so many different styles that you can come out and try. It's just a good opportunity to see what your local brewery has been doing. People will dress in traditional German lederhosen and dirndls while enjoying German beer and food. Brewmasters will also tap two special beers and a cider aged in bourbon, red wine, and tequila barrels to give them an extra flavor. It's a good community thing. Uh, a lot of people get into it. There's uh, there's costumes, a lot of people dress up. If food and beer isn't enough, there's also a non-competitive 5K costume fun run. The Blubber Run, it starts and ends here at the brewery. It starts an hour before the festival. Uh, with your registration for the run, it'll uh, get you into Point Pointtoberfest as well. So Julie, can you tell me if there was one thing you want people to know about Pointtoberfest, what would it be? It's just a great time to come down to the local brewery and see what we've been brewing. It's a great chance to come down and taste all the new flavors, new styles. Uh, we're going to have over 30 different types of beers and hard ciders on tap. Last year we went through about 50 half barrels, so we do have a good time and, and it's a great time to come down and sample all those. And how many people are coming? Uh, we have about um, 1,500 or so that, that show up to this. Uh, we can, we're preparing for even more. This event grows every year. But Point Toberfest isn't just fun and beer. The brewery hopes to raise $5,000 for Pints for Prostates, a national organization raising funds and awareness for prostate cancer. September is Prostate Cancer Awareness Month. So this is a way that we can have this festival in September and create awareness for prostate cancer. All the proceeds go to the Pints for Prostates Oktoberfest for a Cure. Uh, it's a national organization that raises money for prostate cancer research. Um, and, and this is done through beer events, beer festivals across the country. And their slogan is reaching men through the universal language of beer. The third oldest brewery says the brewing industry is ever changing and always growing. Right now it's just great to be a craft brewer. There's a number of people trying new styles of beer and there's so many different types to try and brew here. And it's fun for us and it's a growing industry and that's, it's just fun to be part of a growing industry in Wisconsin. And if there's one word the brewmaster wants to leave you with, it's cheers. Prost.